Good, 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 and welcome to the shortest video you have ever seen. It's finished. No. <laughs> uh, no, I just heard Shom FM uh, do a call uh, telling us about uh, we are the spirit of rock and roll. 97.7. And the reason I'm telling you this is because when you say we are, why don't you say were? But why should you say it, it becomes war? It says war. We are says war. We are. Just a d we and the R says war because the A overtakes the E as an angel letter. So instead of we are, it says war and the leftover letters are E and E. E versus E, 5 versus 5. Freedom of 55, it says 5 versus 5. And then it says you are, which is actually a yard. Because you're a yard. Measure the measurements of how long a yard is, and that's your value in this life. You are a yard. Now, is it metric or is it American? Which one? It's, it's actually both. So you'd have to look them and you'd have to understand it. And then if you say use, <coughs> hey, use over there. Uh, what are we using? What are, what are we using? You're confusing me. What am I using? No, use. It means you and you. A W letter. Use. 21 and 21. It equals the 42. And 42 equals to the 5 number. Again, it equals to 5 and 9. Fighting. And then I went off to saying, okay, we're going to go into now the French verbs. And in the French verbs, they would have they are. And what you have to do in this one is you would just take away the T-H-E because it's a time-heaven uh, connection into here connecting you and your angel. So in they, I just put the, and then I take the Y with the a R word and just say Y, A, R, or yard. Because the E is a passage, okay? It ends at D delta. So you have to use the last omega letter, which would be D which would say the yard. It doesn't say a yard, it says the yard. In the other words where you said you are, it just says yard. Here it says the yard, meaning one of the yards, meaning the metric system, a yard metric, or the one yard, because the one regular yard is 3.2 something feet, which means bringing you back from life, and the other one says I'm bringing you into life, the difference of these terminologies of these words. Now that I'm into it, I may as well go through this. Um, now, I'm not going to completely complete anything completely. Uh, you're going to have to do a little work yourself, basically, in understanding if anything I'm saying is true, if there's a meaning to any of this of what he speaks of. Tic-tac-toe, 10, 20, 30, all the T's can be changed for B's. So you would have, instead of tick, you would have a bick. Instead of tack, you would have a back. And instead of a toe, you would have a bow which means beautiful of your back, of your bick. Bick is your mouth. Because the bick is a pen that writes, but when they refer to you, the only thing that writes is what comes out of your mouth and the gestures from your hands, how you move. Then we go on to the repetitive, if you want, of 10, 20, 30. But I'm going to also reverse this, okay? The tack reversed is a cat, okay? The tick reverse is a kit. So in tick and tack, you have kit and cat. And the toe is the hoe of who you are to know the whole story. The hoe. The hoe. Where's the hoe? She knows the whole story. Everybody thinks she's a hooker. She's a hooker because she got the information. And she paid for it. And she did what she had to. So she's a hoe today because we can't bring her up. We have to lose everything in translation. Um, so now when you have toe, there's so many things you can do with it. So we're, now we're going to jump to 10, 20, 30. Now, what can we change that T for? 10 would be Ben, okay? Uh, uh, 20, you can actually say when of the crossroads of he, because W means creation, which you can also say empty. 20 is empty. It's empty until you get the 30 when something is born. Then 20 is full. That's why when they say 20th, it's not the same thing as saying 14th. E-F, it says. The way it's pronounced means the birth of that 20th position, which is the beta, and whatever, all her terminology, 21 through 29 of what she does, and then everything actually doesn't start until 31. And at 31, you have beta creating a spirit. And 32, 
uh, well, uh, they exit into the world. You see, they exit into the world. They're not exiting out of the world. We keep transferring from one world to another. We have to be somewhere. If we're not anywhere, we don't exist. Okay, and if we don't exist, the molecule doesn't exist. The DNA was never here to start with. So we're somewhere or we're nowhere. So 10, 20, 30, when you go to 30, right, it actually, in French, okay, it says IR, which is ear. It's an expression in uh, French. How can I explain it? Uh, basically, if you look at it, um, if you want to know the opposition to the two letters of ear, okay, your ear is your opportunity for spirit. The ear is um, a rear. It means you're back ending your life from one end to the other end of your ear from going in the spirit and out the other end of your ear or in your mouth and out your butt. And we're talking about the one spirit now, okay? Because um, the four spirit connects you all the way down right to your rear end. And then when it leaves, like I said, it stretches out through your ear until it connects inside the matrix. Once it grabs onto the matrix, it releases your ass end because it always takes the information from your ass and your mouth, don't forget, from what you hear and what you see. You don't know the rest because you're not just talking all the time. Okay, so once it's released and it captures the matrix strand, it releases from your ass and you die. It's over. You're cut off. You're dead. I don't think you can make it by that thing. Once it cuts off, it cuts off. That's why at the end sometimes when you're trying for a breath, because he's stretching out to take you somewhere else. That last breath is because he needs all of inside of you to make the passage to release the spirit from within. Uh, so 10, 20, 30, uh, TY and TY on 20 and TY on 30 is because God is saying, thank you, thank you, yo! Because T is the 20th letter. Toronto, T-O, it's saying, yo, Alev, my student, you're coming down to earth. Good luck, good luck on your adventure, my friends. But be careful for the fox, because the wolf is too cunning for you to be able to beat. So you beat the wolf, the fox by beating those who chase the fox. You can see what they're doing wrong, and you can do what they're doing wrong right. Wrong again. You gotta keep doing the opposite. It's never right, it's always wrong. Because by doing the opposite of everybody's right, you're gonna see the full extension of what the right has as its, has as its own value. The value of right versus the value of wrong is actually the totality in between. And the answer is 5-5. Five, five. It's always 5-5. Five, five. It always has to be 5-5 five, five because 5-5 five, five is the middle. It's 5 from one end, 5 from the other end, and you're right in the middle at zero. That's where we want to start, where all the love is. The game begins here. What are we going to do? Right? So uh, there's also 40, and there's 40, and there's 40 first. 4T, it means thank you, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, but everybody says 9D. 9D coming up, 9 times D is 36, creation of man. Um, now this really weird, weird picture I'm going to show you now. See the one that looks like the reindeer on the right? That's actually uh, the genitals of a man, and the other one, uh, the diamond, that's the woman. So I'm assuming man is a club and the woman is a diamond. And my whole vision of heart and spade has now changed all because of the vision of the sexual effects of who we are. So the woman would be the diamond because she could put it all around and the man happens to be the club because he thinks he knows it all. So in general, it makes no difference. It's just what I come out here to do is just to show you different kind of angles of having visions of seeing something. In this book, that I'm, that I'm in the process of actually more telling everybody than writing in anything at all is all going to be the vision of what everybody else thinks. And at the end, we all know there's something wrong in this world and we have to make corrections. So we must join hands at one point or it will continue on to be the same forever and ever and ever. But that's okay because you won't be here because they don't want to bring you back. Some of us, they don't bring back here. They bring us somewhere else where they need us. And then they use us and abuse us because we weren't smart enough the first time around or the second time around. And the third time around, this is the time of, um, I, I, I was lying down in my bed and I'm going to try and explain it the best we are, but this is the time of the war. The war in the yard. That's the first thing I told you of we are, meaning war. And you are, meaning yard, it means the war is in the yard, 
E versus E, U versus U, the circle of life, E, U, E, A, U. Water. Something to do with water. Does Niagara Falls give electricity? Why doesn't? Why doesn't it give electricity? What's going on under there? Is there something going on under there? Does it give electricity? Maybe it does. I don't know. Anyways, uh, this is the game of the yard dog. And the reason it's the game of the yard dog, uh, that if you look around, you will start to see um, within one day that you'll start seeing a dog. And on one side, it'll say on the dog, it'll be a G and then a D. And that says God, but it's yard dog. You understand? You see the dog there, but it's written GD, which is guard dog. Okay, but this is a yard dog. It's a guard dog. We are in the yard. We are fighting you versus you, which means 42 versus 10. What does code 1042 mean? I know what 42 means. I know what 10 means. 10 is a jack. Somebody's fighting a jack, and 42 is the angel. So it's the angel fighting men. So in all reality, this is only a book. But this is what I feel what's going on in here somewhere in this world. I know there's an underworld game, not of one, not of two, but of three sequences. There's three parts involved in this. And that's why they always call the third country. So they have the level. Every time they say something, um, where did I write this down? Uh, boy. Okay, anyways, uh, I'm going to change it to something else. There's just too many things. Now, I marked down 20. See where I marked 20 and, you know, the old and, the, the and here. Can you see it? See the twist? That's the cancer sign. I said 20 and 4. Here's the 20, okay? 20 and 4, but it looks like 2064. 64 is angel and man. Now, to, re to remove the angel and man, right, we're working with the dogs and cats that fall from the sky like rain, okay, and the time is the golden age, which is 50, so we take away 50 years from this, and we end up with 2014, okay, dog beta date extinction, February 14th, 2012, because the expression of life is in the 14, which brings you to the passage, Okay, but beta incronization only came on the date, really, of Christ in December, the same month. Okay, Christ and her the same month. So what happens is she's born 1 2 alphabet. So it'd be the, the 14th, February 14th, 2012. Okay, and the reason for the 14th is because the two that we reminisced here, we added back in weeks. So we had it week. It was the week part of the month because it was counted by days. February means all the days. This means only of the days. 14 and 12 is 26. That means queen and dog. This, these numbers here say queen dog, February 14, 2012. The reason it says queen dog is because the 12th letter is the L letter, which stands for the queen. But the 14 actually stands for the ace, the most superior card of spirit that you can ever have. 1 and 4, 14, 1 and 4 is 5, and that's a passage. So um, we have to be running into this by February, and I still don't really believe it because I was still working on 2014. So um, everybody else, even if I miss my 2014, I definitely will be able to see um, the 21st of December of 2012 and what it's all about. Maybe it's supposed to be a celebration. Maybe we're supposed to start our, uh, Christmas four days early next year or something. I don't know. But like I said, um, E. Lenin uh, left off uh, a vapor. It was exchanged with Mercury and Venus. Um, I keep seeing down here, uh, somebody showed me a picture. I found a picture on Google that showed that our actual input in this world is between planets 6, 8, and 5. So I'm not exactly sure how it works. Another thing, everybody says Pluto is lost. One of the reasons we don't see Pluto is we're not in the same element uh, area as Pluto. Uh, 2468-1379, uh, there's, a, there's a difference uh, of connection between. And should we be in number eight, okay? Even though Pluto will be next to us and the next number, uh, we're even there odd. But we are in the heaven of eight. 
and it's inside what I believe still is a possibility that it's inside um, Jupiter because they did say it was a Jew's Earth, right? And Jupiter says Jew's Earth. But at the same time, it says the German's Earth. Because Jew, German, that G is just very funny, eh? A Jew of many or a Jewish, it's all like a wish of a, what I want. So it just all mixed me up. And it's really like, almost like God set up this whole world. Okay, it's the Jew against the Jew. And everybody else is just filling in and we're all being used. But it's easy because somebody's paying us and we want it. Would you go to work tomorrow if you had $10 million? I would. I don't know what I'd be doing. But I'm at work right now and I get nothing. So, what's the difference? Um, the difference is, I get the joy to know that I've let out what I've learned. And what I believe is to be true. I'll show you one more thing over here. If you ever go to the site Extra Normal, they have two of these. Olive, Olive. But they're not the same kind of Olive colors that you normally see they look like the olive from the olive tree and this is olive from extra normal olive oil my true birthday April 10th 67 it's pretty crazy eh? I was born in 1963 but there was an equation that somebody sent me from where I have no idea it popped up in an area it can't even pop up it's almost like me talking to you and it'll pop up on my screen a vision of, of, from the background that's not even there and it tells me I'm born on this date and not only that all my life everybody born October 4th and all my life what April 10th April 10th and now I see April 10th and why was it 67 because 1963 was birth of one 1967 is birth of the spirit of man I may have been born in 63 but there was no inauguration inside the who I am until 1967 because I have to pass the four years or the four corners of the general admission into this society what they call heaven and that takes four years it's the same for everybody so all my numbers come out and then actually if you really want to know you're supposed to move back I think it's four months four 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 and if you bring back my birthday four months uh, from October 4th to September to August to July excuse me June Okay, we get June, and that's the month uh, of the love, the love bug. And um, anyways, I'm just trying to justify over something that's really not as, as pertinent to this whole conversation. Okay, I'm going to shut her down a little bit. And uh, we always have to remember, even if we forget, we can always scratch our head and say, Who, 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 who? Oh, oh, no, what are you doing to me? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, this is much better where my communications are no longer in my butt end. My ears are up and I see well. Hey, Carrie Price, I want to play against you. Carrie Price, win, one win, one loss, one tie. But you just jump all around like crazy little loons to shoot that puck around the ice and battle your brains out for the love of the game. And in this world, the game of love starts now. Now is the time you have to visualize what can love be? What is love? Love is a word. That's all it is. It's only a word. What's really important is the feelings you have inside of you and the way you distribute yourself around other people will actually bring the definition of love into consideration of adoption that it really exists. L-O-V-E, two consonants, L and V, a Las Vega, Las Vegas, O and E, the water of the spirit, 15th letter, 5th letter, 5 and 15, 5 that goes into 15, 3 times trinity. You don't think love is a word? Love is 54 letter points. There's 54 cards in the deck without the instructions. You know why we don't need the instructions? Because we're not playing. I'm just telling you how many cards are in there. Well, there's only 52. You're wrong, sir. Because if you're playing alone, nobody knows. Then there's 53. It means you've been exalted from this world. But when you have two jokers, the one you play against takes up the hand of the other joker. It's one joker against the next. Five versus five. This is the time of the yard dog, 
and uh, do I explain to you uh, how this game goes? It's a very difficult game because we've been pushed back because of money. So it's almost like the truth is there's only man we're fighting against on this earth, and that's not true. We're fighting against Beta because she wants to teach us, and part of man wants to destroy us. Well, the rest of us, all we want is love, and we're not sure where to start, and we can't trust very many people anymore. So more is more or less for us. Do not worry. The potency of love you shall see how it rises and will always defeat the evil. Do you know why? Because if it doesn't, you are with them, and you will not see any different from one day to the next. Because you are not with us. You're either with or you're without. Either you want love, or you don't. Forget about knowing what it means. Either you want the goodness or you don't. It doesn't matter to me whether you understand completely. All you have to know is do you want A or B, love or war? Once you start from there, always remember A or B, love or war. Don't take the middle because the only part in war that's good at the end is it made a lot of business. Now you're going into the middle to see what actually it destroyed. Okay, you're blocking out everything. It's left or it's right. There is no center. There is no shopping center. There's nothing for sale. I have nothing to give. It's all within your own heart. It's a blessed belief of the understanding of the goodness of one natured man who built this city on rock and roll. God Almighty, let him be the big old yard dog. Right on, God. You're a creator of all kinds, man. You freak us out. You wrote the greatest books in the world. You gave us imagination and you let us feel like what it feels like to be here. Just being me. Amen. Praise all. Whatever religion you're in, whatever your country is from, some are included, some are not included. It is what it is. Denmark and Finland, Australia. Oh my God, Asia, I feel so bad for you. I feel so bad for you, Asia, more sometimes more than Africa, but I feel so bad for Africa. So once I start naming the names, you see, it's all a scheme. This is all a scheme. Africa's like that for more than one reason, not just because they don't have any money. It started a long time before that. It's an element of putting certain people in certain places just so certain things won't be found out and certain things will be found out so we can spread the word. <laughs> we tricked them. <laughs> we tricked them. We tricked them. <laughs> yes, you tricked me. No one can trick me. Do you know why? Either I let myself be tricked, okay, or I am waiting till I understand it better. So because I don't understand it, it doesn't mean you're tricking me. It means I'm aware of what's going on but I still can't understand what two cards you got in your hand. That's the only difference. I know you're in front of me with a stack of chips. And I got a stack of chips too. But guess what, buddy? We're playing Limit Hold'em in this game. And the last price comes when I say check, you bet. You only have one bet and God comes down and he takes away your spirit. And all your bets are worth but, 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 nothing at all. Be well, my friends. Let us pass on of who I am. I know I am out of the realm and I do not feel into it. Something is wrong. I don't like it. You see, because I do not have the, the strength behind me, I need to take certain chances in my life. Oh, not life risking, but uh, mental risking. And in order to know that I can get back on my feet, even if I fall the next day, not to be locked up the next day. It's the problem. We don't get a second chance too often. You know what I'm saying? I got to go ahead with this and go slow, very, very slow, because uh, I don't want to step on myself or step in my own. Be well, my friends. To all, Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. Whatever you want to pray, I praise you. Amen.